Hi, my name is Lauren, and I just want to show you how to draw a face or how to go about starting it. And because right away, usually what I see when people go about drawing a face is that they're like, okay, I'm going to draw the eye. It immediately just starts looking cartoonish. And then, oh, where's the nose? Things look out of proportion, <laughs> kind of like that. So what you want to do is start with the circle. Say we're looking at someone from the side. And then there's always this rounded rectangle coming underneath, and the face is basically broken down into thirds with facial features. So right where that rectangle meets the circle, that's where the eyebrow starts. And then you go the same angle to below, and that's where the end of the nose should go. So do a simplified shape for the nose, and then right in the middle, that's where the lips should be, generally for basic proportions. So then, think about you're looking at a skull. You fill that in for the skull shape. The cheekbones would be around there, and that's where the teeth come in. So marking that away with your vine charcoal, because it's really easy to erase. I'm gonna go back and draw in things a bit darker for indicators. Here's a simple eyebrow shape. The nose is coming out. We want to put in a circle to show where the front of the nose goes. Follow that circle for a nostril. Okay, and then the middle, I said there is lips right there, generally. Put in that chin. Let's erase some of this dark stuff to make it easier. But all that was there so you had an indicator of where to place everything. Okay, and then let's put a simplified eye. And we're just going to pretend we're drawing a young male. Okay. For the neck, you want to just have it angled out. And finding the ear, you want to follow underneath the nose and the top of the eye. And usually that's about the same distance away from there, 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 in thirds. Okay. And I'm using charcoal because it's easily erasable when you're starting out. Let's pretend we're drawing a young male. And you have the neck angling out like that. So as you can see, that was pretty simple. And I got that down pretty fast. So don't be afraid when you're looking at a face and want to draw it yourself. Because with a few simple steps, you can do the same exact thing yourself.